All right, everybody, Baron here. Welcome back to Home Wars. So, in the last episode of Home Wars, I asked a pretty key question. So, if you're new here, what we generally like to do at the beginning of kind of a long running series is I'd like to go over the comments and discussions that we had in the last video, right? So, uh, first, which, first of which was that I was curious um, what games you guys would like me to play. Oh, I've also noticed that you move faster laterally. All right, so let's can we see. Can we attack this? But I was like, yeah, what? What other? Here we go. And you can uh, defend that by a, a quick retreat. Look at that. We got big bugs coming in, boys. Can we move the supply lines up? No, we cannot. Okay, but I was asking, what other games would you like to see on the channel? Now, a big resounding one, interestingly enough, because the first video today was Escapist 2. It was about escaping prisons. It is so much fun. I'm hooked on the game. Um, the game doesn't come out till I believe it's August 22nd, but I've got three prisons that I can mess around with until that date. So I've got a month to master those prisons and escape in different ways. And the first video is doing pretty well. If you have, if you missed it, make sure to check it out. All right, I think that everybody is, yeah, let's go ahead and end the day. Um, so the thing is, is Prison Architect was brought up. So many people of you voted and asked to see more Prison Architect, interestingly enough. Oh my god, we've got a, oh, we've got the giant ant swarm. Oh boys, oh boys, oh boys. Okay, so before we get into that battle, let's, let's finish this up, right? So Prison Architect, would you guys like to see me play that? I played it very, very, a very small amount a few years ago, and I know that there's a lot of mods. I've even seen, like, a Star Wars mod for it. That would be so cool to have a Star Wars prison. And also, it would fit on this new, like, prison uh, kick that we're kind of on as a channel. What with Escape is 2 being shown off. Another, the other two games that were mentioned were Unturned and Cross Out. I played Unturned back in 2014 a long time ago, and I really, really enjoyed that game. It was a lot of fun. Also, you know how for my indie games, I love when they have like mod support and Steam Workshop support. That game has so much freaking mod support, it's kind of nuts. Um, so if you guys want to see that, if you guys want to see Prison Architect, I want to see someone in the comments say, Baron, I, I would love for you to play Prison Architect, and I want you guys to upvote the, the crap out of it. I would love to see that, because that would be really fun. Why can't I move? Yeah, there we go. There's that lateral movement. All right, so we've got some kind of an extra mission here, but I think the problem with that is I've got three units there, and then they're going to have, like, a whole freaking army. I can't escort with three anti-aircraft infantry. We'll probably have to skip that one unless it stays around, right? Okay, so now getting into this. Yeah, so I'd love to play Prison Architect. And I would, I'm definitely... I was already planning on playing Unturned and then seeing all those comments just reinforced that idea. Very, very excited for it. Okay, so the first thing I need to do... Look at this. I was going to say is we need to check our ammunition because we're actually very low on, on um, spare parts. And let's see, helicopter missiles, what are we low on? We have 50,000 medium caliber ammunition. Okay, good, good, good. Because helicopters are going to be using that. That death party of ants, we're going to definitely need that. Unspecified caliber, shotguns, we've got plenty. Um, but yeah, this one at 50,000, this one, we could always use more. Um, and then we're at 2,400, so we're at a pretty solid amount. Now we've got to figure out, okay, so in, in the last episode, I was also asking, like, in terms of unlocks, what do we think we need to do? Now, Dustin Boer was saying we need to get more powerful artillery, and Gamey Gamer Rocks was saying we need vehicles, because they're going to do some damage, and I would definitely concur. I think, I kind of want to get this one, 40 millimeter autos and a 12.7, that's going to be really, really effective, and they're going to be very mobile. Tanks are pretty good at taking out big targets, but I don't think we're there just yet. So I'm going to buy that one. And then artillery, oh, 130 for that one. Dude, some of these things, I want to get rockets. Oh, man, that would be real cool. That would be really cool. So we're going to go for a more balanced army. We're going to wait on, um, you know, more aircraft, as it were. Now, let's see. Should we buy any? I don't think we need any of that. We should recruit a new army. We just got these new assault vehicles. So let's go ahead and get a supply truck or two, some assault vehicles, some support it with some anti-aircrafts, and uh, maybe, yeah, maybe some infantry, some heavy riflemen, I'm thinking. 
With a sapper would be good, right? All right, and we'll create, eh, throw in a light rifleman. Create the new army. So we've got the next generation of warriors. Now the problem with this is our supply line is so long to get units here. So we're gonna have to rely on these guys. Now, have these guys already been moved? Okay. So how's the ammunition? Is our ammunition good? Just gonna, gonna double check that. Ammunition. We've got the spare parts for repairs and we've got medium caliber ammunition for all these helicopters. I'm gonna go ahead and just, oh, I guess we don't have the money, do we? Ooh. I hope we've got enough missiles because those would definitely keep. Now, here's something cool. So the Tropican Wars was saying that the supply helicopters do supply in the air. We were just out of the materials, out of the ammunition. I am so happy to hear that those things work. All right, so this is our first battle. Now, in honor of the request for Prison Architect and Escapist 2, if the map presents itself, I'm going to, in a battle today, I want to create a bug prison. And like basically not build a base per se, but build one where like they'll funnel in and get kind of trapped in a way. That's going to be the goal. Let's see if we can't pull it off. It all depends on kind of what we're doing. But 200 groups of red ants, right? So another thing that's kind of interesting is in my spare time, I watch YouTube videos, obviously. Like who doesn't, right? But um, what I've been noticing is I, I there's this one channel called Ants Canada. Ironically enough, the guy's like in the Philippines. And he has real life ant colonies. It's such a fascinating channel. Okay, with only 20 seconds of prep time and these flags, I don't think we're going to be able to... Let's see, are our spare parts here? Good, 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 good. I don't think that I'm going to be able to build the ant trap or the bug trap in this one. Okay, so reinforcements. We want to put... We want to put them sappers on the front lines, eh? Hello, gentlemen. You are going to be the first line of defense. All right, now we're going to have the rifles. Ooh, we do have artillery. Artillery are going to be pretty key. Oh, you know what? I haven't checked on artillery ammunition in a hot minute. Uh, definitely want... So we're going to have, what, one for the artillery, and then the rest are going to be over here. Now, artillery... Ooh, we've only got four. It would have been nice to have more, but hey, you know what? And look at this. We've got helicopters. Now, the good thing about this, we're fighting ants. They're not going to be able to touch these helis. These things are going to be able to fire with impunity... And I'm going to have them out further. They're going to increase the scouting distance. As well as... And look, supply choppers will re, will uh, heal them and will rearm them. What, what in the... What in the what, what? They're big. The big helis. Alright, so everything else is on the field except for two light riflemen. I'll keep them. I don't really need to keep an escort. Okay, so... Now we're going to hide that. We're gonna start and we're gonna pause immediately. We're gonna grab this guy. So, if it's ants, um, glue is gonna be key. Now, I'm gonna overlap this glue a lot because there's gonna be a lot more glue slowing down these bugs. And I wanna make it so it's easy for the guy to run down one line because we only have 20 seconds of prep time. That's not a lot. The helicopter should be able to hold off a lot of the uh, beginners. So, we're just gonna go with a straight wall instead of a prison right now. Dude, I'm really on this prison kick. I'm so glad you guys requested Prison Architect. I can't wait to see kind of the feedback uh, that we have in the channel. But like when you guys suggest a game that's like, that's something I always wanted to play back in the day and now I have the opportunity because we've got an indie games channel, bruh, I'm excited about it. And Unturned, I love that game. That was probably one of the games that reminded me, hey Baron, you wanted to do YouTubing to play indie games. You know, I'd kind of gotten stuck in my uh, War Thunder, Wargaming type niche. And, you know, my real passion was indie games. I mean, I just got to be honest. So that is a lot of glue. We still got a lot of battle points. So this guy here, our friend, is going to be doing barbed wire. Now, that'll allow us... I guess we could have built a wall to get both that. That would have been smarter. That would have been much, much smarter. I'm... Kind of disappointed in myself because 200 groups of ants. Now, I'm glad we had the spare parts because if not, these guys would have died. Like, we would have, like, ugh. It, it could have been it could have been real bad. All right. I think that's all we're going to really have time for. So, let's go ahead. Now, you, interestingly enough, are going that way. And I want you to, you know what? Screw it. We'll start you there. 
All right, so we're gonna take the preemptive helicopter strikes out there. I think that's over there. All right, now. Now we're gonna get the shotgun boys on the front line. Machine guns, trucks for now. Oh God. All right, where, where, where are my boys at? Where are my boys at? All right, so I want you in the middle. I think you're ready. To, some, that's not what I'm trying to do. Thank you, game, thank you. All right, where is that dude? There he is. All right, we're gonna march you to here. And he should be able to trigger all of them. Is that one, was that one missed? No, it wasn't, perfect, perfect. Interesting left, oh, never mind. I was about to say the rockets haven't started. Look at this. These missiles, man. We're gonna run out of missiles. I don't think we have ample amounts, but we've got 20 millimeters and I think 30 millimeters firing out of those out of those things. Let's check the old ammunition. I think it's is it large caliber or meat? It was it was definitely medium caliber, right? And then we got the glue. Look, no bugs are getting in just yet. Some are kind of sneaking around here. And oh, actually, that's a that's a thing. All right, now we're going to get these guys back. Interesting. Should we... Should we move these guys up? I think with helicopter support... I think with helicopter support, we might want to do that. Because we've got to keep them from getting 350. They're already at 10% because they're touching... There's, what, those ones in the back, right? So, how do we win this one? Victory when the time expires. Allies have more conquest points than enemies. Oh, but if they get to 350, it's game over. Um, I think we have I think we do have to take... I, I didn't... Out of ammo. But how? How are these guys... See, these guys are not resupplying in the air. I was told they would. Should we just land them all? We're gonna land them. I don't know if this is a good idea or not. Let's see, are we able to heal? They're getting their bullets back. We're getting wounded. All right, we gotta take off. All right, so supply helicopters did not res resupply in the air. And now we lost them all, but we do have... I mean, that was very expensive. That was a very expensive e experiment. I'm, I'm kind of perturbed. I'm a little triggered, guys. It's 30%. Man, this battle's tricky. We did it wrong. We did the defense wrong. But look at this. They're definitely not getting through. We might, we might lose it, but I don't want to lose any more men. We might lose this battle, but we can we can do a walkover right after this, more than likely. Fight another one. I just can't. They only resupplied on the ground. So we should have, I mean, duh. I should have had them resupply back here, but it's like, this is kind of silly. We're going to pull them back. The ants are kind of sneaking out here. All right, helicopters. Gonna have you land. And we'll just, yeah, I don't like the micromanagement of helicopters. I See, that's one of those things where he's like, come on game, you know? But like, that's the thing, man. Developers have their own, their own kind of ideas and opinions and you know, how they want to build the game. It is their game after all. But sometimes I think that old saying, keep it simple. You know what I mean? Oh, this is good. This is good. We're... Wait a minute. Enemy groups on standby. Oh, I guess since we don't have a helicopter, we can't scout out that area. So we're just getting vision here. I guess at the very least... We should have a scout. Heavy helicopter, you will scout out the enemy. Alright, everybody up. They're kind, They're trying to break through right here. But yeah, I, I think in some cases, I would definitely have liked a more simple approach. Wait, wait, wait. Do we have... We've got these scouts. We're going to have to call them up to battle. 
Oh, and you know what? You guys have... you got, Oh, here we go. This is starting to happen. Run out of supplies. They're at 206, and there's so many groups left. I don't expect that we're going to... I expect them to maybe win by points. Hmm. Yeah, I think in hindsight what I should have done is tried to base around here. But with only 20 seconds of prep time, I got a little intimidated by it, but we could have definitely used the helicopter to slow them down. We should have kept these three, and then I don't think they would have been able to pull it off. They might not still, but I'm expecting them to be able to. Look at this. We're going to speed it up by two here. So it's definitely a challenging game, the decision-making process. There's been, I mean, are our helicopters getting hit by artillery shells? Look at that. Now they're all out of ammo. So all that heavy cover that was happening. All right, pull back. And wait, do we still have the scout out of here? Or I guess I called him back, didn't I? All right, well, man. Poop. Tactical error. Yeah, no, that this was a strategic error. The strategic error was figuring out where to put our defenses. And look at that. So many ants have even gotten in. I don't expect this to have too much of an issue. And these guys can actually fire back there. Are you even landed? Are you? I guess they are resupplying, right? So they're kind of hovering. Seems like they're hovering just above the ground. Battle's lost. There you go. See? And they had 44 left. Okay. Yeah. Mm. I'm mad. I'm mad about it, guys. The strategic error. Some of... Ugh, just, just, it's just like... Mm. Now, why would bugs care about little flags? Here we go. This is, this is the excuse this time. <laughs> bugs don't care about little flags, but we gotta... We don't hate the game. Hate your decisions. All right, so there's 69 enemy bugs left out of what 200? Oh look, walkover. That's weird. How? How is that? How is that? What? Is it? I don't know, guys. Looks weird to me. Here we go. I forgot that some of those things were not completely taken. All right, so yeah, okay. So another thing was in the last video, I asked what color. Now Lone Wolf and Smurfy. Both said that they would like to see purple. So we are going to do purple. I think we need a lot of red and blue. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. I can make colors. We're going to make a, a pinkish purple. Um, so what color do you want to see in the next video? Now we got purple soldiers. Purple rain. All right. So we did we lose? Yeah, we did lose supply choppers, didn't we? All right, so let's see. Does this all appear to be in order? This does appear to be in order. We're going to end the day. We're going to move on to the next one. Got a lot of bugs here. Now where it's a defend. This is going to be the ant trap. Now let's check ammunition. I'm not going to make that mistake. I would imagine we might be low on uh, medium caliber. We went down by like 11,000. Spare parts are still strong. Helicopter missiles are low. Oh my god. Well, that's not good. We're gonna buy a lot of missiles. We were out of them, dude. We, we need them missiles. And then everything else seems to be normal. So that's good, we got them aircraft missiles. Maybe the, I think the scout helicopters are the ones, uh, what would you call it? With, should we build another research? I don't think so. Now unlock, I think I wanted to get mortar vehicles to get more artillery support. Or should we go with, this thing it uses 20 millimeter wow we definitely gonna have to buy lots of 20 mil shells then but this guy had a 40 mil grenade launcher and a 50 cal should we get a tank balance right life is about balance baron i can i can hear my father telling me now you know don't don't work all the time and grow your channels also get outside and hit on pretty women you know that this is the stuff and be physically active so we're gonna have balance in our army then as well by Jove. Um, get, we're gonna get some light tanks and a light AA. 
And then one light rifleman. Oh, yeah. Create that army. All right, now we got to what? Move everybody? Order acknowledged. Get into position. Here we go. Roger that. Now we're going to call these guys in. All right, so this one, I wanted to build the bug prison, right? This one might be a good one. Um, I'm pretty sure we're going to have 90 seconds prep time. I'm not, I don't, I'm not pretty sure. I just hope. I hope that we will get a 90 second prep time. Now look at this. This is 160 bugs. Oh, they got freaking yellow jackets. Do we have our anti-aircraft guys here? Oh my god, we do not yet. We do not have, but we do have heavy riflemen. Hmm. I think this is the first group. Oh my god. We can pull back. We're not going to engage the bees until we have, wait, is this it? Seven anti-aircraft rockets. Oh man. All right, so it's going to be probably in the next battle. All right, so this is going to be Bug Prison. Hopefully, we have the time to build it because that is what I want to do, man. In honor of Prison Architect and Escape... Gosh darn it! We're going to do the freaking flags again. All right, but we learned. We learned our lesson. And actually, there's so few of them. So we... we the strategy here... You know, you... Hmm, one step backwards and two steps forward is going to be... What we've done this episode. We took a step backward in the last battle. We took some casualties. Um, oh, I do not want to start yet. I don't know. Let's get the infantry. Sappers first. And. Oh, but I got heavy riflemen. This is definitely going to help. And I got more artillery. And they've got less numbers. We're definitely going to crush them this game, guys. It's, it's not even. It's not even going to be fair. This is bug prison. No, it's not. I guess it's not bug prison. Well, it could be. Yeah, we're going to build bug prison. We're going to find a way to build bug prison. And we're going to do it. We've got so much battle points, interestingly enough. Oh, yeah. Wait, hold up. I'm going to have one for the artillery. And a lot for the infantry. Now, vehicles. Artillery, six. Dude, this is going to be so good at clearing ants. Now our aircraft, our heavies, big bad boys. All those missiles and, what, 30 mil autocannons? I'm still kind of disappointed that, you know, what do you call it? That they don't really do what you thought they would do. They are who we thought they were! Okay, so we gotta build this defense here. I think we're just gonna have to do a line of glue across the board. That's a, it is, no, I guess it's under 200 ants. I think, I think we could get away with, uh, maybe like one row of glue and some barbed wire. Or should we do hedgehogs to slow them down? Building the bug prison. We haven't really gotten to do it though, unfortunately. The, the battles haven't allowed us to. All right, everybody's out to do their missions, except for this little helicopter, sir. You, okay, so, the idea here, it's not, it's not an ant prison per se, unfortunately, we, it's the bug prison. We got, alright guys, let me know how we can build a bug prison. Because that is definitely what I want to do. Alright, so they're going to be spawning in, and these helicopters should be wrecking them. Oh, the missile's going live, boys! Wow, the, the guided missiles, how do I, hmm, it'd be cool to prioritize them. Like, only use missiles on big bugs. Check the statistics. We're going to have these three bases locked down. Copy that. The artillery hopefully has the range. We could pull them up a little bit more. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold up. I almost forgot. About the, the really important stuff, which is our defenses. The helicopters are doing their job in delaying the bugs. But it's only going to really matter because eventually they're going to run out. Look, they're at 55. We're just destroying them, dude. Helicopters, when there's only these ant swarms, are key to success. Now, we've got more points than them because they've only got two, and we've got access to three. So we could wear them out that way. And our guys are building up purple glue. Remember when you were like um, elementary school, or I guess primary school for for is another way of putting it, is um there was like different colors of glue. I, I remember like this pinkish, you know, transparent stuff. Here we go. Are these built? Should be built. Get into position. All right, now we can call this guy back so he doesn't die. But I mean, for the most part, we've got. Order. Order. Attack 
I don't even think these guys are going to have to dispel much ammunition, man. Artillery and helicopters are doing it. So let's go speed this up, boys. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, they're getting to the glue. And now they're getting cut down by heavy riflemen. Look at that. And then they all... See? Hey, I've got full supplies. we got to land, though, to work. Well, I guess, you know, it might as well, right? They're looking at them. They're like, we're tracing them, but there's just nobody to shoot at. The ants are slowly getting through, but we've got extra parts. And I also wish I could, like... There we go. There it is, boys. Resupply, and they're firing from, like, that weird low hovering position. We're almost done. This battle is ours. Oh, yeah, and it, although right after we kill all the bugs, we've got to go out and take it. Let's do that. See, right now it'd be cool to have, um, what do you call it? Like some recon vehicles and tanks to just speed out there. And now we just gotta get, so even, yeah, look at that. We definitely learned our lessons here, boys. Alright, so... Glue is technically a bug prison, but I like how we have, like, these green flags. Look at that, there's police outside, man. Alright, look at that, the little aerial defense. I like it. I like the purpleness. Purple rain! Dude, it's like an airfield back there. Who's out of ammo? Alright, so now we just gotta get the 350. Ladies and gentlemen, we gotta figure out... Guys, guys, guys. We gotta figure out how to build a, a bug prison. I think that is very key. We shall end the battle. Congratulations, General. So you guys have been hankering and pankering and jankering for more home wars. We got it done. We got purple men. Oh yeah, can I can I do uh can everybody move? Nope. We've already moved our supplies. All right, let's So look at that. That's faster than that. Now can we walk over it? Oh yeah, we can. All right, now these guys, man. We got to watch out. All right, boys. So now let's go, let's do a recap, right? We fought the good fight. We've had some pretty good battles. Um, attempted to build a prison. Maybe we could, maybe we could. Oh, you know what I just did? I accidentally double clicked. There, these guys aren't moving. I messed up. I messed up two turns, because I thought it was a bug. <laughs> Which, by the way, bugs are in this game. Hey, the, the bugs just never get old for me, man. I just, I just don't think they do. All right, so we're going to move our soldiers up, move the supply lines up. We got 4,889, and we got a lot of experience. So unlocks-wise, let's go to here. We wanted artillery, and we've got 116 left. I don't think we're going to be able to unlock any of these vehicles. Oh, my God, we're so close. In XP, we're sh four short, and that's a 20 mil. That thing would be pretty good. And this is, what, a 30 mil? 30 mil. Do, 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 do. And this one goes, da, 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 da. And this guy's going, I am the war machine. We've got all the cannons. Now, what about these? This guy. Unfortunately, they don't fight terrestrial bugs, right? What about what about you? Man, we are we're close. I guess we'll keep that, right? Alright, so what kind of oh we could build a huge army this time. Recruitment. Recruit new army vehicles. What did, what, what did we get? What did I buy? Assault vehicle, was it? Yeah, I guess I guess so. I guess we unlocked that one. We get three supply trucks, two recons, a couple assaults, a lot of tanks. Oh my god! Oh my god! This is this army can't be beat, boys. Did we just create an invincible army? I dare say we hope to have done that. Now, do we fight the the bugs? Are defending, man? They're holding back to defend, but they do have. I guess he's, he, this one guy is breaking their AI. This one soldier. So what we're going to do is we're going to end it. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah, because we're... What happens? They're not moving at all. Oh, he did die. Well, look at that. Okay. Have we, have we beaten the bugs? Call up all the soldiers. Hopefully, that's only... Dude, that's how long it's taken. They've got bees popping out. Wait, this could be the really good one. I think this might be... Yeah, the light anti-air vehicles. Bug apocalypse. 
All right, let's move up the supply lines. We've got 2,500. I think, I think once our light AA vehicles get up there, the war is over. So should we try to like actually launch a satellite? I kind of want to do that. I want to launch a satellite. I've never done it. I know it's expensive. We are going to put you here. Do we have the money? We do. We got the money. Yeah, we got it. All right, so now I want to launch a satellite in this room. Launch satellite. You don't have enough resources. All right, so what are we low on? We're low on refined metal and incendiary barrels. We're considerably low on it. All right, so we bought that. I just feel like success is in our grasp. Look at this. Never mind, we have created prison. They're stuck in one area. Yes, I'm so glad. Because I was like, all right, the theme of this video is definitely going to be prisons, right? And we did it. They're stuck to this room. Here's all the guards. This army, this army is impervious. Now, I'm not going to do that secret mission yet, man. I just don't think we need to. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have done it, Baron's Brigade. We've created a prison. They're confined to one area. This is going to be where the final battle is. I feel like once this, once that group gets here, so it's, let's see, one turn. Okay, one turn, two turns, three turns. We'll, we'll win this one. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of all ages, Baron's Brigade, where are you at? You guys wanted more home wars. We got it. And I think we're just about to win another campaign. So in the comments below also, what game should we do? Prison Architect, Unturn, Cross Out. Um, what color should the army be for the next episode? And then kind of like uh, what we might even need maybe next episode. No, yeah, don't do it yet. We'll, we'll do it then. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Hope you guys are having a great day, and make sure to check out that Escape is 2 video that came out earlier.